Hey everyone, how's everyone doing today? Welcome back to my Warfront GTA Vice 800%. So we're going to be starting with Phil Cassidy's missions. Let's go. Starting with Gunrunner. Phil! Run! Run! Ah, wait! Never get a naked slave too close to one of Phil Cassidy's moonshine steals. Shit, Phil. Did you drink that stuff? Hell, you don't have to drink it. Just a good whiff will say you are. Wee. Listen, Phil, you said you could fix me up with some firepower. Sure thing. There's some Mexican gun runner. Been doing me for business of late. He does his weekly run about now. <clears throat> hey. Ram his hardware off the back of his trucks before he goes to ground. And you'd be doing me a favor while you're at it. Then finish him off. Alright, there's a simple way to do it anyway. Let's pick this up. Get in this. Alright, so let's do this the simple way then. Okay. Easy way to do it is you shoot the, uh, the stuff off first. So we'll wait till they get close. Like that. Alright, let's get the other one. Shot his wheel as well. And then you go back to the downtown area. And then you um, do the same again. And then try and destroy the trucks, and then you're done and dusted. Alright, let's try and get him. Then we go back and destroy the other Waltons, and then all what? And then what do we do? Just pick up the guns, and it's that simple. <coughs> all right, these guys are still there, were they? Yeah. Just that guy. Here we go. Then just pick up the guns. And that's all you do. Shotgun. And then we just go and get the other two guns. And then it's, it's simply mission done. Yeah, these bikes are just a bit hideous as well. But, oh well. And then let's go and get the other gun. There we go. Simple. <laughs> Tommy, it's Phil. Now cut out all the reminiscing crap and listen to me, you hear? Good. I got me some extra strength moonshine. It's nearing fermentation time and I just wondered if you'd fancy having a shot. Seriously, Tommy. If you like a drink, or if you need to strip paint, this stuff will make a man out of you. Sure did out of me, even though I can't see out of one eye. I'll be waiting for you. You hear? Hey, Phil. How's it going? Hey, Tommy! How 
Why you just this bitch is locked? I swear you should lay off that boom shine, man. It smells like paint stripper. Just make my eyes burn. Shh, 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 shh Tommy. Hey, come over here because there's something I want to show you. Something. Oof, God, should I be able to smell that from way over here? Don't you worry about the Bill. smell, oh. Tommy. You just watch this. Shitty, cheap bandages or something. There's some more on the bench. Ta-da! That was how Phil lost his arm in uh, Vice City then. Alright, so we need to take him to the hospital first then. Yo, whilst we're the drunk way. as hell. So, <laughs> drunk Watch as out. hell. Charlie the tree line. All good. You better get up to them with. Me or are the roads made of jelly? Oh god. Oh god. Can't see really, so. Oh well. Broke his food. Come out of the inn. You got it. Not the hospital, man. Too many cops in Vietnam. There's an ex army surgeon who owes me a few favors. And a lawnmower. He's got a place down the middle of the van. Oh, look. Giant fish. Oh well. Ooh, good. <laughs> okay, and here we go. There we go. I say no to that man. Phil's place has it completed. <coughs> and we can now purchase any of these guns then. Now we're going to continue with the Facetti missions with Bob Roll. What's the problem? Some bars refuse to pay. They reckon they're protected by a local gang of thugs. But don't worry, Tommy. I can handle it. You call this handling it? You two, off your asses. Let's go. Alright, so we need to take them to the bar in Ocean Beach. Right, get in. Get in the car, useless. Right. So let's get to the um, bar then. Alright, let's take these guys out then. That was easy. Not exactly your lucky day, huh, pal? I have to get the protection needs a little more protection. Ah, oh, hell, not again. 
I don't need this crap. These idiots operate out of DBP security around the block. These guys just sorted out amongst themselves. I'll be seeing you later. Yeah, yeah, whatever. You are in my way. No, we need to go and kill the DP security, right? Right, I'm pretty sure we don't really need these guys, so. So, funny fact is, like, even if they die, they somehow come back alive. I don't know. Right. Right, let's make this mission really simple. And you know what I'm gonna do? That was easy. Simple. And we've got to kill the guys on the bikes. Whoa. Look at me! I'm bored of you! Well, okay, you know, I don't really need these guys anyway, so... All we got to do then is just kill the guys that are on the bikes. So let's just do that. Dead. And this guy. Dead. Come on. There we go. Tommy, we gotta talk about stuff. What's the problem, Lance? It's you, my friend. I feel you're not giving me a fair slice. And more than that, you've been embarrassing me in front of the boys. I can't have that. Lance, it ain't like that. You've been making mistakes. Tommy, I'm not your message boy. I'm not your running boy. Lance, don't screw up and we won't have any problems. I screw up, you can lay into me anytime. Tommy, I've done everything for you. You treat me like a fool. Don't do that. Lance, I won't rip you off or stab you in the back, okay? Just take it easy. This is tough enough without you getting all emotional on me. Trust me. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? I hear you, Tommy. But I can't take this much more. Lance, don't be like this. Now I'm warning you. Do you hear me? Just relax. Take a few days off. Okay? I'll talk to you. You moron! What were you thinking? Do you realize what this means? We could all be so... I the time I must have got screwed. That place was wired to go up like a fireworks factory. And somebody tipped off the cops, but What's the problem, apart. fellas? Mike was supposed to torch some place in the mall, but he screwed the fuses, and now uh, the cops are crawling all over it. We gotta get our stuff and get out of here. Relax, both of you. Let me think for a second. Tommy Versetti just doesn't cut and run. The cops are gonna be going over that building with a fine tooth comb, right? But that takes time. We gotta go in and torch that place ourselves. Yeah, but no one but a cop could get within a mile of that place. So we go as cops. We gotta get uniforms and we're gonna need a squad car. All thanks to you, Mike. I'm sorry. I got it. All we gotta do is lure the cops in with the finger, put them in a locker, and jump them. Good plan. Let's go. All right. Okay, Lance, let's get the cops' attention. Alright. Okay. Okay, so we gotta get to that lock up and then we need to um get a police uniform. So let's just get there, oh god. So yeah, so let's get there. Right, make a turn. There we go. Really irritating. 
see. Right. Now we're gonna wait for two cup cars then. Give up, you prick! Don't make me shoot you by mistake. I'm taking my shot. Tie him up and gag him. Ooh, fits perfectly. Fit tight around the crotch, though. Oh yeah, yeah, mine too. Mine too. There's a cop car around the back, I think. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's get to the mall. Easy, brother. No cop drives this bad. Let's put the cop car like here or something. Remember, smile at the other cops. Hey there, officer. Nice badge, nice badge. Real smooth, Lance. Right. Right, this is it then. Right, let's get in there. Okay, timers are set. Five seconds and ticking. Five seconds! We got to get the hell out of here! Whoa. Right, now we gotta get back to the Facetti estate. With five stars. Right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here, Lance. Right, I really hope he's outside. Yeah, he is nice. Get in, quick. Oh god, pretty good. Whoa. <laughs> right, we need to try and get back there. Right, I'm gonna try and get some police bros if I can though. Damn, these guys are aggressive. Please bribe. It's gotta be another one. There's one here. And then there should be one. Right, it's only one star, so it doesn't matter. Now let's just get back to the mansion. Hey. Okay. That's what we gotta do. Gotta move on. Okay. Right. Send the marker. Protection ring gas it completed. Now we get five grand every time we collect it. If it generates the full. Right. Mission complete. Hey, hello, Tommy, Tommy. We got a situation over at Printworks. You better go and check it out. I don't know, some kind of mess or other. Things are messed up. I gotta go. Tommy, it's me, Lance. Keep your mouth shut there, Tommy, because I ain't got no time to talk. I ain't interested in what you got to say. Why should I be? You don't care about me, do you? You got to look after me a bit better. Give me a spare slice, you know? Hey, hey Tommy, man, look, hey, I'm sorry. It's just that people patronize me all my life, treat me like a little kid. My brother would do that. Please, man, don't do that. I got to go. All right, then.
then so we're gonna end it off here anyway so also we got the next print works mission but we're not going to do that print works mission till after way way till the end of the game so we're gonna leave that print works mission for a while and we're gonna continue with the other story missions so next episode we're gonna be doing the payphone assassination missions so I would like to say thank you lot so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one take care everyone